When adding fractions, it is useful to come to a common denominator, and then we can just add the numerators. So I want to know what number both 3 and 5 will go into. The smallest thing that they'll both go into is 3 times 5, which is 15. So now I'm going to change both of these fractions so they're over 15. I can do so by multiplying 3 times 5 and 5 times 3. But then to keep the fraction equivalent, I need to do the same thing to the top as I've done to the bottom in each case. So I'm going to do 3 times 3 over 5 times 3, which is going to be equal to 9 fifteenths. And on the other side, I have 1 times 5, which is 5, over 3 times 5, which is 5 fifteenths. Now I can add those together because they have the same denominator. They're fifteenth size pieces. 5 plus 9 then is going to give me a total of 14 out of 15. So very close to 1, but not quite there. So I got the common denominator, added my numerators, which are the top part here.